Hi, I'm Jordan, and in this video, we're going to be taking a look at the Wacom THJR. This is very similar to a Windjet that you may have seen that have been out for years, and it works on the same principle that it's a fan and it draws air behind it to dry the paint, which means it's going to be drawing warm air from the booth and bringing it towards the painted surface. Now, one benefit to this is it's like three times the size of a Windjet, and the fan is massive on it. As you can see, it's covering a massive area on the bonnet. So this is a benefit to using these kind of drying tools is that it does dry the paint a lot quicker than some of the smaller ones that's on the market. Also it's not too flimsy like some of the others on the market where you drop them and they break. This one is made out of both metal and plastic together making the whole unit in one. So this is really durable, you know it's not going to just shatter or break when you drop it. It is fairly decent quality, so you do get good quality for what you pay for. The only thing I will say is, if you're not in a warm environment or a spray booth, there is pretty much no point in having this kind of equipment, because it's drawing the warm air behind it inside the booth, so if you're outside the booth or in a cold environment, it's not going to have that same effect. However, the fan on it is still very big, and it is better to use these rather than an airline or another form of drying equipment. So, you know, this still can be used in different environments, it's just that they are best used in a booth or a warm environment. And lastly, I'm just having a bit of a play around on putting it quite close to the panel to see if it is that powerful that it can start blowing your paint, because I'm sure some of you have had that happen to you before. And this doesn't, it is quite a smooth airflow actually, it's powerful but very smooth if that makes sense. So, it is a really good tool to have and I do recommend these, they are really good. If you don't want to pay out a lot of money for a big air dryer, but at the same time you don't want to skimp and get the cheap kind of wind jets, then this is definitely the one for you. And that's it for this video, thank you for watching and check out the other videos on the channel and make sure you like and subscribe.